Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Nina Haley Dixon and I'm keeping you in the loop with the dating scene. And I'm talking about today's dating scene. This is what it looks like. Double tap if you like what you see. Swipe right, swipe, swipe left. left. Swipe up, swipe down. Shake your phone if you wanna come up with a whole new list of profiles. This is what new age dating looks like today in this era. I mean, it's no wonder why men and women lack the basic communication skills in relationship nowadays. And when I say relationship, I'm speaking of all levels, whether it be professionally, friendships, which is your personal relationships, or relationships with your coworkers. Have you ever got an email from a coworker that literally sits right beside you asking for something that they could have easily asked you if they spun their chair around or raised their head up from behind their computer screens? I mean, besties have awkward moments too. When you haven't had a disagreement in the five years that you've been friends and suddenly that day comes where you disagree and nothing is said and the cycle begins. And then there's the boyfriend and girlfriend relationship. Have you noticed that some men and women have the courage to say things via text that they probably wouldn't have the courage to say in person, such as ask someone out on a date or really get to know them? What happened to the valor? Where's the romance? And what happened to those cute moments where we used to wonder how soon was too soon to call? The excitement just isn't there anymore. I mean, I have a million and one people that I want to communicate with on each of these levels, whether it's business or pleasure. There's something to be said about connecting to someone to talk in person or over the phone. You can hear the tone in their voice, see their body language, and feel the energy that they exude. My advice from my personal experience is to pick up the phone and call. This way, your attention is focused on them and it makes each relationship and experience meaningful in its own way. There are at least five people that I speak to on the phone every single day. Two of them are my sisters and one of them is my bestie. For those of you that are dating, this is a great way to tell if someone is really into you. So rather than an emoji or some weird dark pic of a body part that you had to hide to take a snapshot of, be bold and tell that person how you really feel about them. If they're willing to make the time to connect to you through avenues other than text or email, then I think you're already ahead of the game. Keep in the loop.